Imagine peering into a realm where the usual rules of geometry and physics no longer apply. Welcome to the world of higher dimensions. The reality we live in is defined by four dimensions, length, width, height, and the ever-advancing arrow of time. But what if I told you that there could be more? Scientists are increasingly considering the idea that our universe may exist in more than just these four dimensions. These additional dimensions are hidden from our senses, yet they could be all around us, shaping every aspect of our reality. They could hold the key to understanding the fundamental nature of the universe, including the enigma of gravity and the secrets of cosmology. Intrigued? You should be. This isn't just science fiction, it's cutting-edge physics. Let's dive deeper into the universe's dimensional structure by exploring the top 10 theories. Number 10 on our list is Flatland, a world of two dimensions. Conceived by Edwin A. Abbott in the late 19th century, Flatland is not just a mathematical curiosity, but a profound exploration of perception and reality. Imagine a world that is entirely flat, extending infinitely in the X and Y directions. The inhabitants of this world are 2D beings, living their lives without any concept of up or down. They can move forward, backward, left or right, but the idea of above or below is completely alien to them. Doesn't it sound restrictive? Yet for them, it is their reality, just as our three-dimensional world is ours. We, as three-dimensional beings, can easily perceive and interact with this flatland. But to the flatlanders, we would appear as strange phenomena, inexplicable within the confines of their two-dimensional reality. Flatland is a stepping stone to understanding the mystery of higher dimensions. Coming in at number nine is the fourth dimension, the realm of time. It's a concept that defies our everyday perception, yet it's integral to our understanding of the universe. According to Einstein's theory of relativity, we are not just existing in three dimensions of space, but are also constantly moving along a fourth dimension, time. Just imagine we're like tiny boats adrift on the ocean of space-time. We can navigate the three spatial dimensions, up and down, left and right, forward and backward, but we're carried forward unceasingly by the current of time, the fourth dimension. This idea challenges our traditional understanding of reality, painting a picture of a universe where the past, present and future coexist. It's a world where time isn't just a relentless march forward, but a dimension we traverse, just like the other three. The fourth dimension is a crucial part of our understanding of the universe. At number eight, we have the concept of hyperspace, a dimension beyond our perception. Hyperspace, in theory, represents a higher spatial dimension that we, in our three-dimensional reality, cannot perceive or directly interact with. It's a realm that exists outside of our familiar three dimensions of length, width, and height. But why should we care about hyperspace? Well, it may hold the answer to some of the most perplexing phenomena in quantum physics. Take quantum entanglement, for example, where particles separated by vast distances mysteriously influence each other's states instantaneously. This could be explained if these particles were connected through hyperspace, bypassing the distance in our three-dimensional world. Similarly, the idea of teleportation which is the instantaneous transfer of matter from one location to another, could be made possible through a shortcut in hyperspace, circumventing the need to travel through normal space. Hyperspace could be the key to understanding some of the universe's biggest mysteries. Number seven on our list is string theory, where tiny strings vibrate in multiple dimensions. Imagine, if you will, a world where the smallest particles aren't point-like dots, but rather, tiny strings. This is the fundamental premise of string theory, a theoretical framework within which the point-like particles of particle physics are replaced by one-dimensional objects or strings. These strings vibrate at different frequencies, and it's these vibrations that give us the varied particles we see in the universe. But where it gets really interesting is when we start talking about dimensions. You see, in string theory, these strings aren't just vibrating in the three dimensions of space and one dimension of time that we're used to. No, 
they're vibrating in up to 10 dimensions. That's right, 10. Six more than what we experience in our day-to-day -day lives. These extra dimensions might be compacted into such a small size that we can't perceive them, or they might even be larger dimensions that are hidden from us in some other way. But why 10 dimensions? Well, it's not because theorists have a fondness for the number 10. It's actually a requirement for the mathematics of string theory to be consistent. It's a case of the math leading the physical interpretation rather than the other way around. And what does this mean for our understanding of the universe? Well, it could be revolutionary. If string theory is correct, it could provide a unified description of gravity and particle physics, something that has eluded scientists since the development of quantum mechanics and general relativity. This is because the vibrations of the strings in string theory include a mode that is identical to the graviton, the hypothetical particle that carries the force of gravity. So, while it's still a theory, and one that is yet to be proven, string theory offers a tantalizing glimpse into a world of higher dimensions and a deeper understanding of the universe. String theory opens up a world of higher dimensions, offering a new way to understand the universe. At number six, we have M-theory, a theory of everything. This fascinating theory is a unifying principle that brings together all five string theories under one grand theoretical umbrella. But what makes M-theory so intriguing? It boldly predicts the existence of up to 11 dimensions, shattering our usual perception of a four-dimensional universe. M-theory is like the conductor of an orchestra, harmonizing the different tunes of the string theories into a single symphony. But it doesn't stop there. This theory also has profound implications for our understanding of fundamental interactions. It proposes that all known interactions, from the gravitational pull keeping us grounded on Earth to electromagnetic forces lighting up our cities, are unified at their core. Imagine a world where all physical phenomena, all the laws of nature, are interconnected and stem from the same root. This is the tantalizing promise of M-theory an audacious attempt to explain everything in the universe. M-theory is a promising candidate for a complete theory of the universe. Number five on our list is brain theory, where our universe could be a slice in a higher dimensional space. Imagine biting into a sandwich, the bread, the cheese, the lettuce. Each layer is different, but together they form one cohesive sandwich. This is similar to how brain theory short for membrane theory, views our universe. In this theory, our universe exists as a three-dimensional brain or layer within a higher dimensional bulk. Just like the layers of a sandwich, our universe is just one slice of a much larger multi-dimensional entity. This theory is a radical departure from our traditional understanding of the universe. It suggests that our familiar three dimensions of space and one of time are not the only dimensions that exist. Instead, there could be many more dimensions, compact and hidden from our perception, within this bulk. But what does this mean practically? Well, one of the most exciting implications of brain theory is its potential to explain gravity. In our three-dimensional slice of the universe, gravity appears weak compared to other fundamental forces. Yet, according to brain theory, gravity could actually be strong, but its effects are diluted as it spreads into the extra dimensions of the bulk. And there's more. Brain theory also opens the door to the concept of parallel universes. Just as our universe is a brain within the bulk, there could be other brains, other universes, existing parallel to ours. These universes could have different physical laws, different forms of matter, and perhaps even different dimensions. In summary, brain theory is a bold and exciting concept that reimagines our place in the cosmos. It suggests that our universe is not the whole picture, but rather a single layer in a multi-dimensional sandwich. It reshapes our understanding of gravity and introduces the tantalizing possibility of parallel universes. Brain theory redefines our understanding of space and time. It takes us one step closer to unraveling the complex and beautiful tapestry that is our universe. From the smallest particles to the vastness of the cosmos, the journey of discovery continues. 
Coming in at number 4 is the multiverse, an array of parallel universes. This theory suggests that our universe is just one of many, existing in higher dimensions that we can't perceive. Imagine tossing a pebble into a pond. The ripples spread out in a circle, but they're all part of the same pond. Now replace that pebble with our universe and the pond with the multiverse. The multiverse theory challenges our understanding of reality. If multiple universes exist, then there could be versions of us living out countless variations of our lives in parallel worlds. One could be a world where dinosaurs never went extinct, or another where the laws of physics are entirely different. This theory is a mind-bending concept that pushes the boundaries of our current scientific understanding. It's like we've been living in a tiny corner of a vast cosmic library unaware of the countless other stories being told. The multiverse theory expands our universe to an unimaginable scale. At number three, we have quantum gravity, a theory that seeks to reconcile quantum mechanics and general relativity. Quantum gravity, as the name suggests, is a theoretical framework that aims to unify two of the most successful theories in physics, quantum mechanics, which describes the world of the very small and general relativity which explains the world of the very large. This unification is no small task. In fact, it's one of the most significant challenges in contemporary theoretical physics. Now, why is it so crucial to unify these theories? Well, because they describe our universe in fundamentally conflicting ways. Quantum mechanics is probabilistic, meaning it deals with chances and uncertainties while general relativity is deterministic, leaving no room for chance. They're like two different languages that describe the same universe. Quantum gravity is the theoretical physicist's attempt to create a common language, a framework that can accommodate both the unpredictability of the quantum world and the precision of relativity. Imagine a universe where space and time are not continuous, as Einstein's theory of relativity suggests, but rather they are made up of tiny, discrete bits, much like pixels on a screen. This is the picture that quantum gravity paints for us. It's a universe where space and time have a granular structure, a universe where the fabric of reality itself is quantum in nature. Quantum gravity is significant because it could help us understand the nature of space and time at the smallest scales. It could shed light on the mysteries of black holes and the Big Bang, Phenomena where both quantum effects and gravitational effects are significant. This theory has the potential to revolutionize our understanding of the universe. It could change the way we think about space, time and gravity and could even lead to new technological breakthroughs. But remember, quantum gravity is still a theory and a highly speculative one at that. It's a work in progress, a puzzle that scientists are still trying to solve. But who knows, one day it might just be the key that unlocks a unified theory of the universe. Quantum gravity could be the key to a unified theory of the universe. Number two on our list is loop quantum gravity, a theory that quantizes space and time. This is a theory that takes a different approach to understanding the dimensional structure of the universe. It proposes that space and time are not continuous, as we often perceive them, but rather they are discrete, quantized entities. In the realm of loop quantum gravity, the universe is like a fabric made of tiny, indivisible loops. These loops are incredibly small, so small that billions could fit inside a single proton. This theory challenges traditional views of space-time, suggesting that it's not smooth and continuous, but rather it's made of these infinitesimal loops. The implications of this theory are profound. It suggests a universe where space and time are not fundamental, but emergent properties. It offers a new way to understand gravity and could potentially reconcile the differences between quantum mechanics and general relativity. Loop quantum gravity offers a unique perspective on the structure of the universe. And finally, at number one, we have the holographic principle, a theory that suggests our universe is a projection from a higher dimension. This intriguing theory proposes that all the information contained in our three-dimensional universe can actually be described on a two-dimensional boundary. Think of it like this. 
Imagine you're watching a 3D movie. The images appear to have depth and form, but in reality, they're projected from a flat 2D screen. The holographic principle suggests something similar about our universe. It proposes that we're all part of a grand cosmic projection, where the real action happens not in the three dimensions we're familiar with, but on a two-dimensional boundary at the edge of the universe. This boundary, called the event horizon, is where the information about everything within the universe is stored, much like the pixels on a computer screen storing all the information needed to create the image you see. The 3D reality we perceive, according to this theory, is just a complex projection of this 2D information. So, what does this mean for our understanding of space, time and reality? Well, it flips our conventional understanding on its head. It suggests that the three-dimensional space we live in, including everything from the smallest particles to the vastness of galaxies, is a holographic projection of data stored on a distant, two-dimensional surface. This idea has profound implications for our understanding of black holes, quantum gravity, and the very fabric of reality. It could mean that the universe we perceive is not the fundamental level of reality, but rather a projection from a deeper, more fundamental layer of the universe. The holographic principle challenges our perception of reality and the nature of the universe itself. It asks us to consider that what we perceive as reality may be nothing more than an intricate illusion, a cosmic hologram of unfathomable complexity. It's a theory that pushes the boundaries of our understanding and continues to inspire a sense of awe and wonder at the staggering complexity of the cosmos. Isn't it amazing, our journey through the universe and its diverse dimensions? We've traversed from the flatlands of the 10th theory unraveled the complexities of quantum gravity and reached the boundary of comprehension with the holographic principle. We mustn't forget that this is just the opening act. The cosmos is boundless and its enigmas limitless. Each theory we've delved into today is a landmark on the trail to comprehending the essence of our universe. Now, we extend an invitation to you to become a traveler on this cosmic voyage. If you learned something new from this video, and are thirsty for more such fascinating facts, then we request you to support us by hitting the like button, which can found just below this video, designed as a small thumbs up icon. Your likes are incredibly helpful in reaching more knowledge hungry souls like you. If you have a favorite theory or a query about dimensionality of the universe, we are eager to hear from you. The comment section is the stage for you to voice your opinions and questions. Just scroll down a bit and it's right there under the description box to make sure you never miss out on any of our future content. Do subscribe to our The subscription button is conveniently placed below the video. Click on it and you'll join our expanding community of cosmic adventurers. Lastly, if you found this video captivating, why not spread the cosmic wonder and share it with your friends and family? The share button is located right next to the like button. Remember, every like, comment, subscription and share is a valuable contribution to our collective expedition of comprehending the universe. Let's together unravel the cosmic enigma. Scene 13. End Sting. Thank you for being a part of this cosmic journey. Stay inquisitive, stay amazed. Until next rendezvous, Keep exploring.